Hello everybody, here with a product review on Harbor Freight Tools. I'm one that was particular, I love my Craftsman Tools, but as Sears has started going out of business, they've closed a lot of their stores, it's hard to exchange your tools like you used to. You could just walk in the store and if they had it on hand, you could exchange it out right there for a new one. And now, you can't. Stanley bought them out. And they're actually getting back into stores a little bit. Menards has them. I know, I think True Value or Ace, one of the hardware stores is carrying them now a little bit. So, the lines are getting better on them. Their shelves don't have a whole lot on them right now. Menards kind of in between the two. Their selection's better than most of the hardwares. But... Since then, I started using the Pittsburgh tools. I didn't care for them to start with, but their tools have got better over the years. I used to think they was just total junk and, you know, they scrap metal. But now they've came out, they've got the lifetime warranty on a lot of their tools, and they're made a heck of a lot better than they used to be. This here is a half-inch drive ratchet. It is item number 62246, and it's the Pittsburgh Pro Lifetime Warranty Quick Release Ratchet. has 72 teeth, has the push button to release it there, and when you do, the little pin comes out of the bottom, and it lets that little ball go in there, and when you let it back down, it pushes it back out to lock it into place. These heads are able to be changed out. I don't know if you can get those from Harbor Freight or where you got to get them. So usually I just take them back to Harbor Freight and they exchange it out for a whole new ratchet. That's the best way to do it I think if you have one close by. These here, they're, the teeth are pretty close together. There's not a whole lot of give on them. There's a little bit, but these hold up pretty good. I usually end up putting a bar on the end of these to break stuff loose, sometimes lug nuts or whatever, and they've been holding up pretty good. Has a little lever there to change the direction of it. The weight of these are a lot better than they used to be too. They're more heavier and just seem overall made a lot better these tools I've got this hair set I've had up for a little while it's a Pittsburgh Pro set too it's a lifetime warranty half-inch drive and the case ain't too bad on it either it's usually I break these hair parts off because they're just made where they're attached to the case and it's just got a little flap of metal and eventually it ends up breaking but these are a lot better design. This hair set came with a little breaker bar. And I haven't broke it yet, surprisingly. And the ratchet, I ended up breaking it. I tuck it back, they exchanged it out for this one, which is half inch drive also. Just has a different style head on it. But it works pretty good. This kind ain't the quick release, but they're really good ratchets. It don't fit back in the case like the original one does, but at least they exchanged it and comes with also a extension there, and these are made pretty good too. I haven't broke any other extensions, so I think they're really good. When I first used their tools, I broke a lot of them. But these hair sockets are really good too. They're heavy duty. Thickness of them is a lot better than what they were in the past. But as far as their tools, I recommend them highly anymore. So, if you want, check out Harbor Freight. Check their tools out. Like I said, I recommend them anymore. I think they're right up there almost with Craftsman.
but Craftsman overall is still my pick. Just they're harder to get unless you order them online. So don't forget to like my videos, subscribe, comment, hit the notification button, and have a great day everybody. Bye.